In the previous episode, we killed Deerclops and I was losing my voice. And in today's episode, I'm even more losing my voice. I'm so struggling right now. It's going to be a short episode. Um, if you missed my video yesterday, I explained a bit of it. But yeah, I'm, I've lost my voice from BlizzCon and it's just continuing on. And it's a problem. I feel fine other than that, right? Like, I'm not sick or anything. I just got no voice. Um, you guys suggested that I upgrade my Broken Biome Blade. Um... Which one is it? Yeah, so we get rid of this one and we put it in the ground to get this thing, which sure, that seems interesting. <laughs> what was that? Hold left click to conjure searing blades in front of you. They get larger and stronger the more you hit enemies. Blades can also be used to bounce off tiles in the air. Okay, yeah, sure. We'll try that. Um, and then the frozen one. Um, I'm on this one now. Is this going to change the right one? Oh, it's not doing it. Oh, uh, hold on. What are we on? So, goodness. I'm on this one. I want to change to this one. I don't know if it's going to work. Hold on, let's look. There we go. <clears throat> I like the I like the frozen one. So, I need to go into the dungeon today. Um, and get a shadow key in order to get some some uh, boxes open but also the abyss has some stuff in there too so i'm just gonna quickly head over there do i have a way to get over there oh you know what oh, what's gonna be faster honestly just running this way is gonna be faster so i'm gonna run over there real quick and we'll start going down and this episode may very well just be the the dungeon unfortunately i tried i tried so bad this is actually the best i've sounded all day I've left it to like the last minute for getting this this video up, um, but like I was sitting on the couch earlier. My wife and I have been playing a lot of Stardew Valley on our Xbox. It's been it's been a lot of fun actually. It's been it's been a bit since I've like been able to sit down and really sink my teeth into a game with her. Um, that wasn't something that I was also doing work for, like Diablo Four, for example. And it's just fun to be able to hang out and play that game, but. I was trying to talk to her and she was just like, you just got to stop talking. <laughs> She's like, you were so losing your voice really bad. You just got to stop talking. <laughs> and that's been my life today, which is unfortunate. But, you know, it's kind of expected, honestly. Coming back from BlizzCon, something's going to happen. Uh, in 2019, I didn't get sick at all. It was great. Um, not that I'm sick now, but I didn't get sick at all in 2019. Uh, everybody around me got sick. And she had, uh, my wife it's like completely set me up with... Like a vitamin C, vitamin D, and uh, like elderberry, and like a bunch of other, like, it, it was like four to, ooh, a mechanic. It was like four times the amount that I actually would ever need. <laughs> but it was just going to boost me right before BlizzCon, and it worked. Um, and it worked again this year, I didn't get sick. But man, just the shouting. The shouting during day two really messed me up. Um, it wasn't just day two, I guess. It was also day one, but it, oh, that trap calamity is cool now um yeah i just got way worse <laughs> the more that went on the more i had to shout it's just uh it's a it's a problem oh, no i'm gonna die oh no oh that got real close there man i filled up my inventory so quickly but we got a cobalt shield so that's pretty good um make shield of the high ruler i see like high high rule right that's a, that's a i get that reference um 37 true melee damage, 15% crit chance. Grants immunity to knockback, 12 defense, very strong knockback, immune to most debuffs, plus 10 max life. Grants an improved shield of Cthulhu dash. Um, life alloy, really? Where do I get life alloys? This is like, this is like pretty deep, isn't it? Yeah, cryonic bars, perennial bars, scoria bars. It's like deep hard mode. And it doesn't seem like that <laughs> is that great of a... Anyways, uh, we can get a obsidian shield, and then we're pretty far off from getting the onk shield, but you know what? It's, it's, it's not bad. Um, I got a lot of these staves. I'm going to sell them because I don't need this summon. And I'm pretty happy with our current... Um, with our current progress in the dungeon because I got my shadow key. But I'm also kind of feeling like uh, it's time to just... Kind of forget about the dungeon because that's all I really wanted was the cobalt shield. So we can go ahead and pop that in there. Let me get rid of this armor. 
um, take our shadow key. We've got a shinobi blade. I'll just put that in there because is there any bone things in particular I can make? I can make the Muramasa, which actually is pretty nice because that gets that out of the way. So that way we can actually make the Knight's Edge, um, which is something I can do once I take down the Slime God, which will probably be next episode. So let's pop in here. Um, let's get rid of this stuff. I need the shadow key in my inventory, don't I? I was like trying to think for a second there. If it, if it would work in my, um, my piggy bank. Wow, I'm just not able to think today. Can't talk, can't think. Man, it's terrible. It's terrible. We're pushing through. Let's get over to the abyss. Wasn't there the crest, right? The ocean crest, was it in this? No, it does not look like it. Okay, so crest. Is that ocean something? Oh, come on. Oh, I've got it. I've, <laughs> I've got it in my inventory. Cool. So we'll get that. We'll pop this in my stash. And we will go to the ocean. Hopefully. Yay. Okay, so we're off over here. Hopefully this doesn't hurt me, right? Um, I think I need to go this way. Right. Nope, that's going to make me float. <laughs> I was hoping that would make me fall. Definitely did not. Isn't there something about being able to fall faster. I think this is an item that we can get later. I have no idea what just hit me. But I know that with the shadow key, we can get stuff. And I know that this has been kind of redesigned. Ooh, we're already seeing it. Ooh, I like this a lot. What is hitting me? Jeez. Is that the urchin? There's no way it was the urchin that did that damage. This is really cool. Okay, so the abyss before, I kind of hated. It was constantly dark. I have no idea what's doing damage to me. I wish I had like a debuff to tell me. What is this? Is this a computer thing? Oh, is that laboratory screen? What? Something is definitely attacking me and I have no idea what it is. That's unfortunate. It's just annoying. I, w I wish I could... <laughs> cannonball jellyfish. What the hell is a cannonball jellyfish? That sounds... That felt... Really bull crap. <laughs> I almost cursed there. That was I, I don't usually use language on the the channel, but that was total BS. Why why is this cannonball jellyfish popping at me? I gotta keep an eye out for that. Oh, I had a thing there already. I think this cannonball jellyfish is just kind of a BS thing. It's just gonna constantly deal damage to me. I don't think there's any way to get around it. Sulfuric poisoning. Is that what it is? Oh, I see. That's what it is. Okay. Here, let's head back. Did I have something that could, could, uh, remove that? What else did I pick up there? Oh, the beacon prototype, the summon. That's not bad. Um, let's pop that stuff in there. Get that in there. Okay. Let's, let's quickly look. So who, who would it be? Which there was a lot of fire blossom. Oh my goodness. Sorry. My brain is all over the place right now. Let's get this fire blossom. Hey, and if you're watching this video, by the way, and you're like, man, you're a champion. <laughs> you're a champion for doing this with losing your voice and everything. That's what I do. That's what I do. And if you like that, if you like that, you should consider becoming a channel member, supporting the channel. Um, I don't know if they've done it yet, but it seems like YouTube is going to be quickly making it that channel members may have, um, may not have ads anymore on their chosen channel that they're watching, which would be great, actually. I noticed, uh, so, side story, side story. I noticed I was um, on YouTube recently. In fact, I was, was visiting a friend, and um, this was on my way back from BlizzCon. I stopped in Nevada where I used to live and visited a good friend of mine. And, you know what, there's nothing here for the, for the sulfuric thing, the poison. I know there's like a, potion or something. I don't know who has it though. Is it any of these guys? Probably not. I think maybe I just got to deal with it. You know what? I'm going to look it up while I, while I quickly tell this story. So I, <laughs> I'm on my way back and, um, I, hold on. Let me, what was I thinking? Sulfuric what? Was it sulfuric poison? Calamity sulfuric sulfuric poisoning. Okay. What, what the heck is this thing? How do I get rid of this? 
<laughs> I haven't gotten an item yet to do this, I don't think. And I don't know where they're at. It's It's been a while since I've done early Calamity stuff. Anyway, so I'm on my way back. I stop at a friend's house. And, well, first off, actually, I, I brought a bunch of stuff back with me because I used to live with this friend. And I was very happy to find my stuff. <laughs> so I got... Um, I got some really cool stuff like my my Stargate SG-1 Collector's Edition. Comes with all 10 seasons, huge box set. This webpage is not loading. I'm getting upstream request timeout, so I'm just gonna have to deal with it. Let's go back over to the ocean. Also I have the five seasons of Stargate Atlantis on Blu-ray and then the two seasons of Stargate Universe on Blu-ray. So I was very happy <laughs> to get that stuff back. Stargate is one of my favorite shows of all time of all time so i'm th that that was like a a very happy thing to have found uh-huh i've I, I, I got so tired of that i quickly looked it up it's the effigy of decay that you have to make so when placed down nearby players can break breathe underwater this effect does not work in the abyss wait nearby players are also immune to the sulfuric poisoning okay that's what i thought so we just got to take that and pop it down as we go. Can I make like multiples of those maybe? Possibly, Sul sulfuric, Sul sulfuric. Uh, no, okay. There's the armor though. This also grants underwater breathing. I think the full set may make it so you, I don't have enough wood. Um, I think it makes it so you can actually reduce the uh, poison too, so. Let me know in the comments if that's actually the case, and then I'll make sure I make it. At this point, I've totally lost to the point on going to my friend's house, other than picking up my Stargate stuff. Oh yeah, that totally works to remove the poison. Okay, that's nice. Is there anything here that I actually need? Oh, that's how oh, urchins again. I'm I'm hoping that I can find more chests. Like there was the oh, it's not over there. It's down below, I think, a little further. Hmm. If I could just take this thing with me and keep popping it down too, that'd be really nice. We're going to see very quickly how far down I can actually get without having that affect me. Oh, this is a shale. What's that for? Sandstone, shale. Okay, just a block with a very interesting sound. Um, like I said, okay, you know what? I'm pretty close um, to it still, but we're going to have to pop our way back and forth, I think. That may help. Oh my goodness, with this weapon. Thank you. I keep, I keep switching to it and it keeps going to the wrong one that I want. I really like this uh, frost one. What I was saying about this though is the abyss used to suck. I really didn't like the abyss ever. Um, it was a cool concept, but man, it was always way too dark, which sucks for a YouTube video. So like I'm constantly having to consider what this is like for you guys, right? But then on top of that, um, just the the content was very weird you know having to get stuff to go further down while also just um having to like find random crap <laughs> on your way down like there was the con the idea of it the idea behind it was solid i think it's cool the way that it ended up playing out was well a bit annoying um especially as a content creator so I'm kind of happy that they've gone and tried to redo it a little bit. I think it makes a big difference. There's a chest. The Rusty Medallion. Uh, causes the most ranged weapons to release acid droplets from the sky. Yeah, we don't need that. Got a, a potion though, right? We'll take one of those. Loot all. Let's go look down here. I think I'm going to quickly get to the point that this stuff... Yeah, I think I'm too low now, or I'm getting too low. Oh man, this weapon, this rogue weapon, or magic weapon though. Seriously one of the best. It's so good. I love that weapon more than I should. Ooh, more chests. Okay. Torrential tier. Yes, please. Love the torrential tier. What are all these? Are these like actual things? Oh my goodness. Oh, that made me jump so hard. <laughs> Whew, was not expecting that. I am expecting these enemies to be far too strong for me. So let's just kind of keep that in mind here. Oh my goodness with these weapons. Let's pop over here. I think I can... Okay, so I got that chest. I got that one there. I think there's one right there. Did I miss this one? I might have. Let's check it. No, got that one. Wasn't there a chest? 
this one? No, nope, got that one. Can I can I get this stuff? Oh, planty mush. Yes, I can. What was this used for? Let's find out together. Man, that's hard to break through. Uh, mush. This is used for the silver stuff. Okay, we're ways off on that one. Life root. I'm not gonna make that. Again, we're ways off. Depth cells. This is a fathom stuff. This is the uh, summon. Silva, silva, silva. And the cool looking hard mode melee weapon. Cool. I might be a little too low. I, I, I think I think the rest of what I'm gonna find here is not gonna be doable. Like I got this thing coming at me, this viper fish. And I think I've I think I've reached my limit here. We'll see what we can do. Oh my goodness, this thing got a lot of life. Yeah, I'm not used to things taking that long to die. And now I'm starting to get the breath issue. Open this up. Okay, we got the plating. The plating is really nice. Reduces the creature's ability to detect you. Reduces defense reduction that the abyss causes. Get rid of our wings. Um, so I got the boots still, so we can still boot it up. Toss one of these down. Did I get that one? I thought I did. Oh my goodness, with these fish. <laughs> oh, that was a mistake. All right, well, we're getting some stuff here. I think there might be a melee weapon for me down there. Let me know. Let me know in the comments, please. Oh, I need to rest my voice. I'm, I'm feeling like, like I'm really straining here. Let's get our treasure. I love these treasures. Just give us a bunch of random crap, uh, which is nice. I just don't know if going down into the abyss is going to be worth it. So again, let me know if there is an actual like melee item that I need. Otherwise, I think we're going to head into the underworld, start clearing things out because, you know, after we get the, um, any items that we want from this, including stuff, you know, in the, uh, underworld, then it's time to do the slime god. But I'm going to do that. We can actually talk. <laughs>